In 1848, gold was officially discovered in California for the first time, and word got out fast, with thousands of people arriving in search of a better life in our great golden state. Imperial County's rich mining history played an important role in the state's gold rush by having the first gold production site in the state. Before the gold rush, Imperial County had Spanish and Sonoran soldiers, settlers, and laborers all mining gold in the mountains of the southeastern portion of Imperial County, known to us as the Chalkin' Mountains. Early accounts tell the story of two young boys who were playing up in the mountains, trying to prospect gold like their fathers. They returned to their camp after their day of play, with gold all over their shirts and pants. The two boys discovered that the Cargo Muchacho Mountains, as they came to be known, were loaded with Imperial County gold. Cargo Muchacho translates in English to loaded boys. It's difficult to estimate the area's gold production during the Spanish and Sonoran eras, but it neared the millions when it was all said and done. From there, Imperial County became more of a destination as more miners came into the region and led many to set up camp and incorporate themselves into small townships in our valley. Through this rush, many new jobs were created and the region began to flourish. Though many of these towns are no more, one historical site that can be visited today is the town of Hedges, renamed Tumco in 1910. This ghost town once supported a population of several thousand in the late 1800s, and by 1900 had several dozen buildings, two cemeteries, a dance hall, a volunteer fire department, and a miners' union. Sadly, the population of Tomko was reduced to just 30 by 1942. Mining town like Hedges, Ogilvy, and Tumco all played major roles in leading the way to new mines in the area, such as the Picacho Mine, Gold Cross, Gold Rock Mine, Pasadena, Guadalupe, and American Girl Mine, which brought in major investors like former California State Governor Henry Markham. Mining played a significant role in the history of Imperial County and still continues to this day with operations like the Mesquite Mine currently operating near the Glamis Sand Dunes area. The Mesquite Mine has produced more than 4 million ounces of gold since it started its operations in 1985 and has averaged approximately 130,000 ounces per year for the last 10 years. As we continue looking toward the future, we look back at the rich history this county has. It is because of the groundwork laid by these hardworking pioneers that the Imperial Valley stands ready for new and exciting opportunities. Thanks to them, we present to you Imperial Gold.